Dean Tool animated tonight, boys. He's ready. Island fight 68. Pensacola Bay Center. Here we go. Hands real low from uh, Lewis. Lewis. You think with the jabs, but we've seen a couple nice little jabs here by Luther Smith Jr. Some, sometimes, man, you know, people fight better with uh, their hands low, man. Uh, we'll start it. It looked like a slip. It looked like a slip. Good right hand, though. Nice jab. A couple good jabs in a row there by Lewis. Smith Jr. really trying to stock up that right hand. Yeah, yeah. You can tell he's wounding that right hand bad. Nice. Nice head moving. Smith Jr. looks like a little bit more of the emotional fire. Like I said, Lewis looks very stoic, very calm in there. Yeah. <laughs> Sneaky little. Set break. Sneaky little. Set break and then go. Hey. Mayweather Ortiz, protect yourself at all times. Ortiz ain't been the same since that. Right. Smith Jr. looks like he always tries to try to get to the center of the ring. Brock, how important is that to really try to grab control of the uh, of the atmosphere here? Yeah, man. Uh, Staying in, stand in the middle, you know, walking somebody down, definitely in a boxing ring, is a big key factor to winning because it, it, it looks it plays a part in the uh, in the judges' eyes. One minute left. Now three minute rounds. We have an extra minute here of round one. You also get a, uh, you don't you don't use as much cardio right. controlling the ring instead of having to bounce around. Running and chasing and Running and, and cutting corners and stuff. You know, people, people's got that style, you can do that. But like I said, it, it'll, it'll wear the gas tank down. Junior definitely seems frustrated. He's just missing. Oh, big left stuck. Started to chase his prey. Yeah, and, and you know, that's probably what he's got to do. He has to get in there somewhere. Ten seconds left to round one. He's getting uh, maybe outpointed with the jab. Judge there, a lot of kind of, um, you know, holding and grapple and a lot of movement. Um, Lewis had a couple nice jabs. Smith Jr. looks like he's really trying to stock up that big right yep. hand, almost like what Deuce just did in the previous fight. Looks like he's trying to look for the one punch instead of just boxing and just let the organic win come to him. Yeah. He, uh, Junior uh, kind of looked like he had uh, maybe a little nerves at the, at the beginning of the fight and in the round, and uh, that first round always shakes it out. I always, I'm always like kind of tired after the first round. I don't know why, you know? And are you waiting for that win to come back? You're waiting for that second win, and when it goes, it's time? It's time. I know his corner is probably screaming to him, do not let it go to the judges. Especially that corner. That was the corner Especially. of the African God earlier. Especially that corner. Smith Jr. is ready the box. Like he's yeah. He's over the nice. Uh, nice. tactics. Yeah, he, yeah. He, yeah. he looks. He looks. He looks a lot better in the eyes and body this this round to me. Yeah. Yeah. Larry Downs Jr. calls it a slip. Lewis is trying to, he, he's starting to get that jab roll. He's starting yeah. to really feel yeah. it. Yeah, and that right hand's quick too. He's, he's, he's letting him fall into the side and he's stepping with that right hand every time to the side. Hey, put him out! Hey, 
I like that nice. a lot. If Larry Downs nice. is going to let it go, come with us. Nice. nice. Smith Jr. really starting to throw some bombs here in round two. Yeah, Lewis can't get too comfortable. Smith Jr.'s corner is asking him to drop the hammer. Oh, beautiful. One, two there by Lewis. Yeah, like I said, Lewis is, is, is fading to his right, and he's stepping in with a pivot step and throwing that right hand every time right there. Watch, watch. He fades, and then he pivots on that right foot and comes in with a, with a, with a little short, crisp right hand. The sweet science of boxing. Yeah. When somebody's chasing you and not cutting you off, that is a perfect move. Yeah. He's following him, he's following him. He's gonna, if he'd have followed him, he'll step right in, right there, see? Step there. Barely missed it there, Barry. Barely missed it. It's because he's following him, though. If you cut him off, he can't do that to him. That's what I mean, next week when you get back, you get back in that ring, that's, that's what you gotta work on. Yep. Cutting off. Don't chase. Bad stuff happens when you chase. Yes. I think uh, I think Junior's starting to fade. He's, he's very frustrated. Right, and he's the his corner's the one that asked for oh, the extra power minute. jab. Though. Nice jab. He's using his height too with his head with his uh, headlock control. That that little stuff like that, man. It'll wear it'll wear a shorter opponent down. Uh, Logan Paul Mayweather. It didn't work on Mayweather, but it, it neutralized Mayweather. Right. From getting to finish. Now you know you're in 2021 when we go to boxing references and we say Paul and Mayweather. <laughs> Can't even believe I said that. <laughs> There's some big fights in the works here too, like Fury and Wilder's going at it. October 9th. Spence, Pacquiao. Yeah, I can't wait for that. Uh, we were talking with Masvidal about it. Masvidal is a huge Manny Pacquiao fan. Me too. He says, he's a fighter's fighter. Yeah. Like, you, you gotta love Manny Pacquiao. Yeah. You can, tell, you can definitely tell he's a great dude. Love his, love his punch combinations. Love how he's still so active. It's amazing with his tender that he's gonna go against one of the top three, top five guys in the world, Earl Spence. The dude's not scared of nobody, bro. He fought Mayweather with a uh, hurt shoulder and I think uh, bruised rib. Right. You know? he, and everyone can say that after the fight, but you can just tell, you can watch that fight. Yeah. Man, he he wasn't the same. He didn't throw he that. He wasn't Pac-Man. Right. You know, he fought him. Yeah. But he wasn't Pac-Man. But he's also fighting the best in the world, too. In right. The undefeated Floyd the undefeated. Money Mayweather. Guys, we are round three here. Very tight fight. I think Lewis probably stole round two. Beautiful footwork. Yes. Nice, clean jabs. Smith Jr. maybe round one. Round one. I'd, I'd give it one one. Three minutes to gain a victory here at Island Fight 68. The better boxer wins this round. See? Lewis with a couple big strikes. Yep. He's really sound, starting to counter almost every jab that's been actually right in front of us. Good turn. First couple of rounds was Lewis more of the grapple. Now it seems to round three. Uh, Smith Jr. has done it two, three times. Nice, oh, nice little short right nice there by Lewis. Short right. I saw it coming too. <laughs> Breathing heavy right now. Smith Jr. out of the red. We really haven't threw uh, too much body work, you know? It's funny how that progression really, it, the more experience, the body work starts to come. The Man. pros, round one, they're just, it's body. Body, yeah. body, body. Yeah. These amateurs, you know, they're going for a knockout. They're going for that big, yeah. heavy right. Yeah. That comes with experience, though, man. The, the the science of getting in and, and landing a good, effective body shot, it takes a long time with timing, slipping right. in, slipping out, man, you know. Well said by Brock Weaver. Uh, Joe Rogan and John Anik, watch your asses. 
with some nerves that second round he started finding himself in that third round he went for the kill man he got it great really performance by aaron great. lewis in his debut yes yeah yeah that was, that was a great debut performance he very smart stay composed let him follow him picked his shots counters the jab the right hand and the finish i think it was a two three two The first finish in boxing so far here. Beautiful performance by Aaron Lewis. Nice. That gets you sponsorships. That will get you dollars. That will get you the girls. Knock out people at Island Fights. Sure. Christopher J just pointed and is like, Rock doing his thing? Yeah, Brock Weaver's doing his thing, man. You heard about the mic before? Come on now. Come he knows my now. mic skills ain't, ain't rusty, Come man. on, Come now. on. I'm four weeks off the mic. Hope you guys are enjoying the show at home. This is Island Fights 68. Now wait, there are big plans in the works for Island Fight 69 and 70 around the corner. A massive year so far for 2021 for Dean Tool. Cannot wait to see what's next in the bag. Aaron Lewis is uh, looking good in the win. You know, some guys just look better when they get the W. Yeah, he's feeling himself right now. Oh man, that's, there's nothing like a win. It's addicting. Lewis seems like he's holding his body. Maybe he got a little body shot earlier in the fight. But a third round knockout win for Aaron Lewis. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, our referee, Larry Downs Jr. Steps in to call the halt of the battle 154, round number three. Declaring your winner by TKO, Aaron A. Lewis. I'm with your winner, Aaron A.J. Lewis. Aaron, man, great job. You know, almost went the full, full three rounds there. Um, your coach was yelling at you during the fight, throw that two, throw that jab. You didn't really seem to get a pop until round three, and then you went to work. And when you fired the jab, you got the twos, you got the threes, you got the TKO. Take me through, man. I knew what he said. That's it. That's it, man. Uh, what do you think of your opponent? He's a good opponent. He's a good opponent. All right, well, listen, man, you're, you're now 2-0, oh, man. Good things are in your future, man. Thanks for being here tonight. Congratulations on the big win. Y'all give it up right now one more time for Aaron A.J. Lewis. <laughs> 